bunge wa eneo bunge na nyeri mjini Duncan Maina Madenge almarufu DMM amaweza kuwarai madaktari na ambao wanaendeleza mgomo kote nchini kuweza kurejelea kazini akizungumza kwa njia ya kipeke na runinga ya GTN katika eneo na ambao kwa barabara inaunganisha maeneo ya Skuta Kagemi uh, na Rulingo uh, ina imekuwa ikikarabatiwa iliyokuwa chini ya ujenzi mkubwa bunge huyo amesema kuwa serikali sasa haina kitita cha kuongeza matabibu hawa huku akiongeza kuwa wanafunzi walio mazoezini bado wako chini ya programu za masomo akisitiza anayafahamu na anaweza kufahamu vizungumkuti wanavyopitia ila akiwauliza za kuipa serikali muda kuna kwamba iko tu na mwaka mmoja onosu ofisini I am a member of the health committee in parliament and we have had the issues raised by doctors uh, through their union the KMPDU and also the clinical officers through the clinical officers union these are the clinicians that actually treat our people in public hospitals and they have legitimate grievances. However, when these grievances have not become come to the fore in the last one and a half years that President William Ruto and the Kenya Kwanza government has come in place. Uh, the issue of internship, for me, I am taking a completely different stand and approach. The reason being, an intern does not have a practicing license. You can never practice medicine, either as a clinical officer, or as a medical officer, or as a nurse, without the practicing license and registration. So these are people who are in training. We have a very grave danger. When we allow students in training it doesn't matter the level where they are in. The truth is, an intern without supervision cannot run a hospital despite their medical qualification. Because they've not had on the necessary number of, of case roads to be able to independently operate on their own. So, internship is part and parcel of the training program. When you look at uh, nurses who are trained at a drip from a level, they do three years at KMTC to finish the nursing diploma program. But while they are still in KMTC, they go for their internship for six months. And therefore, by the end of that internship, they now graduate. Having covered both the, uh, the formal training for diploma and internship, there is no way that the nurses union can go on strike on the basis of the students who are still doing internship. I believe that model should apply for all medical cadres that are undergoing training. Let internship become part and parcel of the training program and therefore remove the politics of unions, labor unions, from the training of health uh, healthcare providers. Nam pia mie na 